Hello beautiful people, welcome to a Silver TV channel, the channel that gives you the true picture of what goes on in Aba, Abia State and Nigeria. Today we took a walk down People's Road in Aba. If you recall, if you have gone through our playlist, you will find out where we presented People's Road when the contractors were at work. And we did promise you that once in a while we will give you updates on the happenings around there. But to our greatest surprise, we ran into a channel that presented the flip side of what actually is going on at People's Road where the video clip tells us that rain flood have started washing away the newly constructed road at people's road this burdened us to go and find out exactly the veracity of that video follow us as we show you exactly what is happening at People's Road in Aba. This is the beginning of the Lincoln Road through Obo Hill near the Enimba Hotels. As you can see, construction work is still ongoing. Ashfalton have not reached this area. The road you are seeing is still being laid and work have not truly completed. As we move on, you will see the area that was claimed to have been washed away. Nothing of that sort happened. What actually happened was that during the rains, due to the topography of this area, the water flowed from the top of the hilly area carried the debris and all the deaths from that area and flooded the third road, making it seem as if the third had been washed away. Just have a look at that video I'm talking about. Viewers, I personally cannot see this type of reports and uh, sweep it under the carpet because we have had the uh, similar reports in Anambra State sometime just some weeks ago we are uh, destroying some part of uh, just some little part of a uh, newly constructed road that is still under construction and uh, the thing went viral all over the place all over the internet and the uh, similar one has happened here that may even be worse in Abia State under the leadership of uh, Governor Oti of Abia State. The information is coming from one particular channel that is called Doom Television, that's D-O-M-E Television. You can search it up in the internet, it's there, that's on YouTube. And the video is there, it posted, uh, it was posted about 30 hours ago. That's when the video surfaced. You can see, you know, there are so many comments attached to this road. So people were saying substandard work. So it's not only Soludo that is doing substandard work, that Toti's own is even worse. You know, a lot of comments concerning this uh, road that was washed away just as i said earlier as you can see here in this video these are just nylon papers and all the dust that warren waters carried from the hilly area and dropped here and you, and you can see also that the owners of the area knows the topography of where they are living and you can testify that no such thing as washing away the road that is being constructed happened here. This place you are seeing, the pole and the ladder, is the place they showed you 
has been washed away, as you can also see, that top topography makes it easy for flood water to fall from up down into the drain that has been provided. So this is only sand that rainwater carried from elsewhere and covered the, the tan, as you can see. It's not being washed away. So I'm bringing this video to you so that you'll be aware of exactly what is going on in People's Road. Nothing of such happened as you can see in this video. Keep watching. Another Wahala, the second day, the second day of the rain. We have seen another thing. This is people gathering everywhere. This is the second day. We reported this the first day. Another one has happened today. Look at the main road. Look at the main road. Look at people's property. The water answer entered inside this place, inside this shop now. Look at it. Look at it. Even this yard, that's where people are coming inside. Look at it. Anya report to Allah. Look at it. Look at it. In here, I'm going to put a yard in the mud. In here, I'm going to put a yard in the mud. In here, I'm going to report to Allah. In here, I'm going to put a yard in the mud. In here, I'm going to put a yard in the mud. In here, I'm going to put a yard in the mud. Look at it. Look at it. Look at it. Look at it. They have many maybe three properties in the mud and they are building. We can't mini zero on the second day after yesterday. Never diminish it. We have many zero today. We can't mini zero today. Look at the road. Never diminish it. Look at where the rain is coming from. Look at it. Look at the new gutter. Look at it. Look at it. There is problem. There is problem. We made our time to bring this video to you just to put the record straight. People's Road was never washed away by any flood rain. As you have been following us and you have seen for yourself. The only thing that happened was the nature of the area makes it that when the rains fall and there is heavy downpour, it carries sand from the hilly areas into the third road. You are seeing here a very big tunnel or canal, they say, that the governor have constructed also to ease the flow of rainwater into the Aba River. So there is nothing like substandard work being done in any area in Aba as claimed by this video. We bring objective coverage of events and how they are the benefit of our viewers. Thank you for your understanding. Continue watching Seabook TV. Subscribe to our channel for more important updates and highlights major events happening around town like our page and share this video to your friends as we promise to always give you objective reportage of events as they are we will also like to encourage residents of this area to build cement pavements as most of the people around here have already done build the cement pavements that you get to the drainage point so that flood waters will not disturb your buildings any longer. Enjoy the good works of the governor, Alex Oti, who have for the first time in history given the people of People's Road quality third road that will stand the test of time. Walk along with us as we get to Emily Good Junction where you also see the water fountains that was provided for the people of the area by Governor Alex Oti.